Hey guys, Philly NJ here. I'm here to show you how to unbrick your FT232 if it's been bricked. And um, what happens is on the latest Windows updates, they brick devices. They've been bricking devices that they deem to be counterfeit. So this is how you unbrick it. What you want to do is you want to uh, go over to the FTG, FTDI chip website and go to the utilities support slash utilities.htm and download the prog 3.5 and prog 3.5 go ahead and unzip it and go ahead and boot it up and you want to see right now this is a default template now you notice that on the default template the product ID is supposed to be 6001 we'll go ahead and do a scan and see if my item has been bricked you scan it found the device read and parse and as you can see my my product has been bricked so go ahead and change it to 6001 click save give it a name in this case I'm calling it test 2 hit yes click program and I got my device back so that's pretty much how you unbrick it now the, the good part about unbreaking it is that you can now take it disconnect it and connect it to a Linux or Mac machine and it's gonna start working again if might be that it, when you go ahead and plug it it's when you plug it right back into the Windows machine it's gonna brick it again so then you have to use a workaround and install the um, the drivers manually but this is how you unbrick it I hope this tutorial was helpful thanks